All right, Simon, a tough loss for your club against the Abbotsford Canucks. Just uh, take me through, I guess, how you saw this game uh, from your team's perspective. Uh, I feel like this game could uh, have gone either way. Uh, our per first period wasn't that great, so uh, two, two nothing down. Uh, I think that's made it real hard for us. What adjustments were made in that you know, first intermission? Because like you said, it looked like Abbotsford did have a lot of momentum in that first period, but it looked like the, the switch sort of shifted, if you will, in that second period. Just what was said in that first intermission to sort of switch things around there? That we need to get out, get out of uh, our D zone uh, quick. Uh, one DD and then quick up. Uh, and also to stay in the offensive zone. Uh, and no like, uh, flipping around in the neutral zone. How have you enjoyed the uh, increase in playing time? Again, this we, we talked about before uh, on the road trip how you had a little bit few more minutes. And now there's more guys back up with Winnipeg Jets on the taxi squad. So you're seeing the ice a lot more. Just, I guess, how are you enjoying uh, the advanced ice time, I guess? Uh, I really enjoy it. Uh, like every player wants to play as much as possible. Uh, so yeah, this is great. Uh, I enjoy it. You also were able to find the back of the net today. Take me through what you saw in your goal. And uh, it was also a big one for your club, too. Yeah, uh, I just try. First of all, I was meant to be a one-timer, uh, but then I felt like he was in the lane. Uh, so uh, then I just made a wrist, wrist shot, uh, and it was yeah pretty good. But in the end, it wasn't enough. Um, obviously, too, though, there's just a lot of guys that are missing from this lineup that you know started the season with the Moose. You might not have gotten the two points in this game, but just what does it say still to put up that kind of an effort where it's still a full 60-minute game? You guys were never really out of it, um, you know, and, and you get to face them again tomorrow, too. That must be nice. Yeah, I mean, every guy that uh, comes in and uh, does a very good job. Uh, so we have a nice group uh, that uh, really likes to play uh, with each other. So. Uh, yeah, we're looking forward to tomorrow. What sort of adjustments are you thinking you'll have to make into tomorrow? I'm guessing they'll have a different goaltender in it, maybe a few different players in the lineup too. Just uh, what are you expecting for tomorrow? What sort of changes do you need to make? Uh, I think we need to be sharp in the first period uh, to set the to set the tempo there, uh, and then continue like we did in the second and uh, third period today.